Well, how do there, chums? I'm going to be continuing my game in Towers of Azkabar. Let's jump on in. Okay, chums, so I think before I do anything else inside of this town, which there's quite a lot of missions and stuff for me to do, I think I'm going to be taken to the sky. And, uh, oh yeah, over here, I've been given a new thing. Ah, where's it gone? I've been given a glider. I've been given a glider. Um, I just took off my... There you go, there's, a, there's the glider. Sweet! Let's give it a go. Oh, heck yeah! Look at that! So I got given the glider at the end of the last one, so as soon as you get this town established, you get given a glider. But what I think I'm going to do is ride all the way back across the bridge and go back to my first area of the map. So I'm going to go all the way back over here, which could be fun. Oh, there's a little request there anyway. We're going to head down here, we're going to head back over here, and we're going to head back to my original town. Because I've got that yarrow fruit, hopefully I've still got it in here, yeah, there it is there, I need to give that to my old tree guy, and hopefully it's going to grow a bit. So I have got my mount now. If you didn't see me get the mount, I'll put a video link just above my head there. Go watch that so you can get your mount. Right now, anyway, you don't get your mount till you get to the second island anyway. Okay, well, I'm near the bridge. I can see it right there. But look, I've come across this. There's some sort of structure here on the way back. Let's have a look what this is. Okay. You see... Uh, at the moment, I don't, I don't think I can do too much about that, to be fair. Okay, and we're heading across the bridge. Pretty nice. There is that fishing mission somewhere around here, but I don't think I'm going to stop for it. Not yet. Oh, chums. I've just had a look, and you see my king tree right there? It actually says I need three yarrow fruit. <laughs> so I'm going to head back, I'm going to go get that, and I also need a load of dung, which I could do with feeding some more creatures. So I'll reconvene when I've done those two things. Yeah, right, there we go. Oh, great. Didn't actually manage to hit it enough time. It's got to craft another one of them. Okay. Give me the yarrow fruit. There we go. We've got a yarrow fruit now. Cool. Well, while I'm here, I might as well climb up here, get some more seeds, plant them, and make everything lovely. Yeah. Right, well, I've now got enough of the yarrow fruit. So I'm going to start riding back again. And I figured I can get the dung at my old tree by feeding the creatures there. There's not many berries plentiful in this region. We're heading back across the bridge again. Okay, well, I've made it all the way back to here. Let's just turn in the yarrow fruit anyway, just to free up a little bit of inventory space. But I need to get all my dung. I think I've got a load of dung back at base. So. There we go. We're turning that. Now we just need the dung. So hopefully there's some creatures that actually eat root. But just head on back over here. Do you eat root? No, I guess not. All right, well, we'll leave a couple of bits around anyway. And we'll head on over here and I'll see if there's any dung. I'll get the lettuce as well, because we can throw the lettuce down and hopefully they'll eat that. While I'm here, I might as well make a few more buildings. So I might make this one. I need to craft some rope first before I can actually make that. So if I go into here and just craft free rope, oh, I can craft free anyway. Perfect. And if I go back into my build menu, into here, I should be able to make this. Cool, I haven't made one of those then. Like, one I made before was the one further down, so we'll make that. Sweet. Let's place that. Okay. This one I might actually... No, nah, I'm not going to put it in the confines. I'll put it further down here. Cool. And we'll put it about there, I think. Let's rotate it round so it's facing this way. Let's make it so this one's got a neighbour, shall we? And we'll put it there. Yeah. Kaplowy! So now we've got two next to each other. They're slightly different. Two different types of hut. Very nice. Okay, right. Anyway, let's go back to the tree then and let's um let's see if we can feed some creatures. I could do with getting some more berries. I have got some lettuce on me. Okay, so now I'm just feeding creatures, just fed him. He likes mushrooms, which is cool. So if you can't remember what creatures like, you can scan them using your scope thingy and then just feed them whatever they like. But yeah, it's um, 
I'm not, there's not a great deal of creatures here, to be honest. It's like, what's that one over there? That one, I think, likes roots. Hmm. Yeah, he likes roots. Okay. Yeah, I've done scanning him. Let's get some roots then. And equip. And uh, let's throw a couple of... They all seem to be up on this hill. I'll throw one there. I'll throw a couple around here. Hopefully I'll be able to see the poo a little bit better over here. There we go. They're coming out now. I just stand up here. Hopefully I'll be able to run over. Pick up their dung. Oh, he 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 they dropped temperate seeds. I'm after your poo. I, I don't really want temperate seeds. Dang it. Okay. How about you over there? Do you like root? There you go, he's coming for it. Just um crouch down. Let's just wait for him to come get it. There you go. And he's eating now. And hopefully he's going to dung. Go on, poop. Well, he... Oh, I got a strange seed off of that one. When you want poop... Oh, there we go. I've got some poop as well. That's good. Okay, right. Let's head back over here. Let's see if any more of any of these strange seeds that I put down. Or roots, I should say. No. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's all I'm doing right now is feeding creatures to get poop. I've now got 30 dung, so I can hand that in too. Sweet. Done. Here we go. This should make it even bigger. Sweet. Oh, look, we can now do strawberries. We can make a strawberry plot. And I think I can do a pumpkin plot as well. Oh, that looks freaking great. Okay, I wonder what's at the top of it now if I climb all the way to the top. Well, my health got increased. Oh, I wonder what they want me to do next, though. Oh, okay. Ecosystem grown to tier three. Okay. Seeds planted from ecosystem. Right. Harvest grand seeds from the crossel tree. All right, okay. Feed juva. What the fudge is a juva when it's at home? Okay, right, well, I might have to head back to my other town, but I want to get established the um, the sort of teleportation. Right, so now this tree has little ledges to help you sort of get a bit of respite in between climbing. And it needs it because it's freaking monstrous. Oh, look at all these seeds that are here now. Okay, right, let's just uh, take a brief. Ah! Budgeon heck! Okay, that's not good. I'm going to fall all the way back down. Right, it's going to take me ages to climb this with the jankiness of the controls, isn't it? Okay, all right, here we go. Right, a little tip is when you actually get somewhere, if you crouch, you don't actually fall off as, as easy. So just make sure you crouch and then hopefully you're not going to fall. It should stop you from the falling bit with a bit of luck. Is there any more seeds around here? Oh, there is. There's one over there. Don't know whether I can get over there, though. So I'm going to have to uncrouch, uncrouch, and press and uncrouch, climb a bit around here, then drop, crouch. Okay, there's a bit of an art to this, but hopefully you're going to get used to it, people. Hopefully some of these little tips are going to give you a little bit of a helping hand. Right, uncrouch, climb again. Here we go. I'm getting used to this climbing malarkey. Crouch. Yeah, don't move anywhere unless you're crouched. Sweet. Uncrouch. Get ready, climb. And we're at the top, and we've got the colossal seed yet again. Holy moly. That's one heck of a freaking view, people, isn't it? What a beautiful game this is. It really is. I'm loving it. Okay, looks like we can put some growth inside of this. So, not enough amity. All right, all right fine. I thought feeding all those creatures would have given me more than enough amity. But you know what? I should be able to plant that big seed that I got. And spread this even further now. So let's um, equip this then. Yeah, use it then. Okay. Temporal ground seed. Alright, we'll put one right near to my base now. Why not? Sweet. 
And there we go. We've got one right near my base now. Freaking awesome! Heck yes. Right, well I've got loads of seeds on me, so I may as well just plant all those out. Which we've got 13 of them. Yep, so let's equip that. Use. Let's go stick these around here then. Oh, okay. That sucks a little bit. Oh, there we go. I can plant them here. It's very panitiky in where you can plant stuff. But I'm going to expand this out. Okay, so I've done quite a lot of growing around here. I even used fertilizer on all of these plants that I just grew around here as well. And yeah, and a lot more growth into this area. Just why not? Might as well. Cool, yeah, that's a lot more amity in there. Cool, and look, there you go, I've got these that I can now harvest. Right, yeah, inventory is now full, story of my life. Right, let's go see if we can get these places linked together using the teleporter system. So let's head on over and let's see what the teleporter now says. Okay, so the teleporter system was somewhere along here. Um, it was, there we go, this is it, here. Let's see what I need to put into it. Yeah, just some amity. All right. Is that done now? Can I use it? Cool. Can I teleport back to my other teleporter? Is that it then? That's Millhaven. There we go. I think that's active now. Yeah, I can teleport. Teleport in successful. Heck yes, people. So there we go. Now I can teleport between towns. So I think this is a good guide for you know how to get your teleporter active when you have to teleport them to and from. And I think next mission, well next episode, I'm going to be hitting up all the markers for all these people here. And then maybe the episode after that I might travel back to the bridge and do the fishing mission. Or I might do that next episode. I'll see how I feel as I'm making this video, as I'm putting it together. But that's how you use teleporters from site to site. Is there any cost to teleport back? Let's just give it a go. Because I can just teleport back and forth now, right? Yes! No cost! I don't have to pay any amity at all. Which is good to know. Oh, that's so cool. Because my storage cases are right here as well. So I can just put everything into storage. Leg it back. Teleport back. I like it. This this is good. Let's teleport back to the other village. Let's just doubly make sure it's definitely working. So now, I suppose, I could probably do a live stream one day where I just go around and try to activate as many teleporting sites as possible. All right, see you tomorrow, and catch you for the next episode. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Destiny.